Hello, welcome to the latest breaking news. In this video, you will see important news on use of trending and breaking. Please like this video, subscribe this channel. I didn't realize how many Big Brother 26 cast members were on tape before, and I have mixed feelings now. Big Brother Season 26 is a thrill ride thus far, so I hate to be nitpicky about anything about it. We've watched the house guests living day to day in previous seasons. And while I'm proud to be a live feed viewer with my Paramount Plus subscription, I'll concede it can often be pretty boring. That's not at all the case this season, and it's forced me to confront a franchise question I struggle with. Is the season this enjoyable largely due to recruited house guests who have previously been on television? While some Big Brother fanatics following the online conversations may be aware, those who are only watching episodes might be in the dark about several seasoned 26 house guests previously appearing on television. For those finding this out for the first time, let's get up to speed and talk about why I have such mixed feelings about this. Heading into week 5 of Big Brother, there are 12 house guests left in the game. Of those 12, a third of them have previously appeared on an unscripted television series of some kind. Here are the ones we know about, for those curious. In addition, we know that week 5 Ho Tucker LaRuriers is friends with season 22 winner Kobe Calafiori, and that Kenny Kelly knew season 21 houseguest Kat Dunn. Once again, it seems like the casting gang is a mixture or recruitment based on who applicants know, which has to be pretty frustrating for the many who auditioned and didn't make the cut. Fans try for years to get attention from Big Brother's casting teams, so it can presumably become maddening to realize that some house guests are possibly being pitched just for having on-screen experience. Granted, we don't know if one or any of these house guests were recruited specifically because of these appearances, or if they were just people who continually auditioned for various shows and got lucky. Perhaps the casting directors had their own connections to other shows mentioned above. Still, there are so many random people who apply to Big Brother, to the point that I can't help but shake my head whenever house guests bring up having originally auditioned for Survivor or Love Island only to have ended up in the house. I want to see Bob Sessits who want only to be in the game as cast members. That said, this latest season has made me realize I have been unfair with my views about this situation over the years. It feels hypocritical of me to call out Big Brother's casting team for grabbing a number of house guests with television experience without also acknowledging that this has been the most entertaining season we've seen in years. Angela's big blow-up on Matt Hardman was iconic, and Brooklyn was getting heated in the house after the week 5 veto ceremony put her in danger. Can we also point out that the surprising vote flip that sent Cedric Hodges out of the house didn't happen without Kor and Kimo Apaka's legwork to get it done? Let's also remember that Kenny Kelly auditioned for years to be on Big Brother and was begging Cedric to send him home when he won the week three Ho. Is it time to admit that the casting department knows what it's doing by casting people who have been on television before rather than newcomers who may realize they bit off more than they can chew, committing to a game as intense as Big Brother? I'm not saying this season has completely convinced me that recruits are a good thing. And I'm not saying that spending five minutes on a game show can give someone the exact headspace needed to be a Big Brother champion. But I'm certainly thinking about it differently. Big Brother airs on CBs on Sundays at 9 o'clock p.m. at and on Wednesdays and Thursdays at 8 o'clock p.m. at. Stay glued to those live feeds for more of what's going on and for CinemaBlend to make sense of it all before the big episodes. 